This is this. Ah. And here you have ta da da dum ta da da dum ta da da dum ping ta da da dum boom and then only a few times ta da da dum and then only the bass single bass and then ta da da dum because it's technically too complicated huh? mm -hmm. otherwise but here ta da da dum 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 everywhere oh. all the time it's going on ta da da dum ta da da ta da da here it stops you see? Mm -hmm. So uh, this is one of the things Martin did when he made a, a rearrangement mm -hmm. for piano. Uh, I think when he wrote this, he thought of this, he wanted this, but ah. it's impossible on the uh. guitar. But you can give the impression. when you play you can make this uh, important but you, sh you still have to hear Th these notes because it makes it kind of it's a kind of danger uh -huh. start here different part starts. Uh -huh. Here the in the in the in the in the piano this stops. But you still have a little bit this uh -huh. in the background it makes it uh, it's kind of danger coming. about this part this part because you see all the uh, this like a uh, uh, constant beating under it ta -da -dum, ta -da -dum, ta -da -dum, danger beat ta -da -dum. what's going up what's going to happen you know? ta -da -dum, ta -da -dum, like this it was a bit late he said excuse me and then Segovia didn't answer ah. <laughs> wow. Wow. so he was very upset Maybe impossible to play. Excuse me for the delay. Uh -huh. <laughs> Sad. Yeah. So about the the, the form. Uh -huh. uh, you see the common jig means like a jig, mm. and it's it's like the the air in the beginning and the prelude, uh -huh. first movement. It's based on early music. And a jig in the sw and Then you have the three against two. Ta 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 ya pa 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 ta ti ta 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 ti ta. But I prefer to play it like this. Yeah, ta 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 to make this line come out. Why? Because here it's written. Here, the, here it's written apart, you see? Oh. What he didn't do here, he did do here. And it goes on different. Again. So here he writes down the the different lines you see the the the, the chromatic skill mm. which we found here mm. is written here with the steps up mm -hmm. 
Like this. So I, I that's why I do it here. We can we can look how it's in the uh, yes. nice thing. There are some details here uh, in the piano. And do you remember the first theme? Material from the first theme, first from the prelude. This is the structure. Only thing is tonality we didn't discuss yet. B. Start with B. Like the first movement. Mm -hmm. like, uh, so it's very symmetrical. First movement. There, B. Just B. F sharp. What's F sharp and B? Dominant. Dominant. So, fifth. First. You see, and a nice thing at the end in the coda, in you have uh, um, and here this is the same. Huh? This time no accents, no no crescendo, just quiet. The piano, and here it goes to dominant, very strong. But here tonic, easy. He has to go to the to the tonic. He wants to add in the tonic. So five one, very classical. You see? It's very interesting, huh? But it sounds very complicated. Thank mm -hmm. you.